If a robotic assistant can make its own decisions, has powerful physical capabilities, and works closely with humans, how can we trust that it will perform its task reliably and safely? In this scenario at the Bristol Robotics Lab, the BERT-2 robot is helping to assemble a table by handing the right components to its human co-worker. It has to move safely around the human and observe his behaviour to determine when it's safe to release an object. We can test the robot in realistic settings, but it's not possible to test every conceivable scenario. The human and robot both have a wide range of behaviours and even subtle movements can have a significant effect. Simulations offer a way to run many more tests, but they are not perfectly accurate models of reality, and there will still be limits to how many tests our computers can run. To go one step further, we can use formal verification techniques. Specialised software tools can examine every possible scenario and say conclusively whether the robot will satisfy its requirements. But in practice, these methods only work for highly abstract models of the interaction, so there is a risk that important details will be omitted or modelled inaccurately. The RoboSafe project has explored how we can apply these three techniques individually and in combination, taking their different strengths and weaknesses into account, in order to provide a more confident assessment of a robotic assistant. At the Bristol Robotics Lab, we've particularly focused on user testing and a systematic approach to simulations, to test our system as thoroughly and efficiently as possible. We've shown that advanced verification techniques from the software and microelectronics industries can also be applied to collaborative robots. Using models of human reasoning and the robot's behaviour, we can automatically identify interesting scenarios to recreate in our simulations. For more information, including a list of related publications, visit robosafe.org.